Doug, good morning. The state says this is a temporary solution, but with a cap on emergency shelter space and more, uh, more migrants arriving by the day, the long-term solution is very much in doubt. For the time being, though, conference rooms in the state transportation building at 10 Park Plaza are now a makeshift shelter for migrant families. The space at Mastock can only accommodate up to 25 families a night and only for two weeks. Activists for migrant families are working together looking for more permanent housing options as outside temperatures drop. People have now been um, creating a Google Doc, you know, using the technology we have available yeah. to start keeping each other informed about where there could be possibly um, places for people to stay. Homeless and shelter advocates held a candlelight vigil last night to call on state lawmakers to fund an overflow shelter. Governor Healy recently capped the number of families allowed into emergency shelters at 7,500. As of Friday, 92 families were on the wait list. Last week, the Massachusetts House and Senate failed to come to an agreement on funding an overflow site. Reporting live in the newsroom this morning, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB News Center.